Hey fellow workers, my name is Kim Zeeber. Welcome back to my channel. Often when I use the word homophobia, especially in spaces that aren't exclusively leftist, someone challenges my usage, saying that it isn't an accurate term, that it isn't a true fear. Except I argue that the word homophobia actually does describe a real fear. People who express or even feel homophobia are afraid of what the presence of gay people means for society in general, and even are afraid of others perceiving them as gay. They're afraid that marriage equality will destroy the family. They're afraid of being overwhelmed by queerness, that queer sexualities are being shoved down their throat, or that there are too many identities and initials in the 2S LGBTQQIA acronym to keep track of. They describe queerness as a lifestyle and are afraid that this lifestyle will erase their own. They're afraid of their children being gay or more specifically being turned gay. They're afraid of people thinking they're gay, particularly if they're a man. It's why they avoid pink, why they don't stand too close at public urinals, why they don't wear jewelry or skirts or makeup why they don't have lingering hugs with other men. It's why they react so abruptly to anything that might be interpreted as a sexual advance, sitting too close together on a couch, sharing a bed, or touching a body part when talking. To say nothing of their responses when people actually do come on to them or even come out to them. When my oldest came out to a friend, for example, one of the first things she asked was whether my child was attracted to her. Fear. My second oldest is serving a church mission in Quebec, and he's had some missionary companions who are quick to tell people that they're not a couple. Fear. A few years ago, when I was in the YMCA waiting room to pick up my children from classes, a big burly guy noticed my painted nails and just stared at me with a stern look, like he was ready to pick a fight. Fear. Around the same time, I went inside a gas station to pay for my gas, and the clerks were giggling to themselves about my painted nails. Fear. And it's that fear that drives homophobic people to sometimes react in abusive ways through slurs and even physical violence. Straight society has a lot of garbage to clean up before straight people can say that homophobia isn't an actual fear. Thanks for watching. Thanks to all these subscribers and Patreon patrons who make this video possible. Please visit my website at kimsiever.ca. You can also follow me on social media. Just search for Kim Siever on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Tumblr, and LinkedIn. If you appreciate the videos I post here on YouTube, the news stories and opinion pieces I write on my news site, or the content I share on my other social media accounts, please become a monthly supporter at kimsieber.ca support. If you agree with the points I raise in my video, please give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below why. Please share my video, subscribe to my channel, please click on the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Look forward to talking to you again soon. Solidarity.